Hello everyone, in this video, I will take you to visit the Vietnam War Memorial in Sacramento. Take what they have left and what they have taught you with their dying and keep it your own. And in that time, when men decide and feel safe to call war insane, take one moment to embrace those gentle heroes you left behind. The U.S. Army Major Michael O'Donnell. Major O'Donnell wrote these moving lines while serving in Vietnam. He thus expressed the deep feelings embodied in the Vietnam Veterans Memorial a tribute to 350,000 Californians who served in Vietnam. The memorial dedicated in 1988 is a personal reflection on the daily life during the war. Its series of rings symbolize the circle of life. The outside ring is made of 22 black granite panels engraved with the name of the 5,822 Californians who died in the war or are still missing. Each soldier is remembered in his or her first and last name, military branch and rank, hometown and age. The inner ring depicts life during the conflict. It features four life-size bronze statues, a pair of men in combat, two exhausted friends, a prisoner of war, and a nurse tending a wounded soldier. This is the first memorial to recognize the contributions of the 15,000 nurses and doctors who served in Vietnam. In the center of the inner ring, a northern bronze statue depicts the 19 years old combat soldier he rests his helmet, holding the M16 rifle and reading a letter from home. He had one of those faces. All of the youth sucked out of the eyes and color drawn from the skin on white lips. You knew he wouldn't wait for any of it to come back. Life had made him own, he would leave it out own. How do you feel when the 19 years old kid tells you from the bottom of his heart he's gotten too old for this guy of war? Michael here, the Vietnam War correspondent. The memorial means many things to many people and as such, is the most visited monument in the park. Some come seeking the engraved name for, of the loved one. Others come to reflect on period in history when so many young soldiers lost their lives. Some leave photographs, poems, flowers for hope for the fallen hero. I came to Memorial two years in a row since I moved over here and it's on the April 29th just to remind me of the Vietnam War where I grew up also to pay tribute to appreciate all of those unsung heroes who have laid out and sacrificed for the Vietnam War. Many, many people lay their lives 
for this country, the country where I grew up. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you feel the same way I do. Freedom is never free. Thank you for watching and I hope you like my video. Please subscribe, give it a thumb up, like to support my channel. Thank you so much.